uh, video bomb. <clears throat> ended up getting rained out uh, the other day and so now we came out to finish weeding or de-weeding um, the strawberry bed and so now you get to see how it actually looks without all of the weeds and grass and they have grown pretty well um, just because of all the grass we haven't been able to get the strawberries on these in the bed because they just it took over so now we're giving it that chance to go ahead and start putting out strawberries with this basil plant i ended up clipping this one's bloom before it came and it grew two more stems so this is where it was clipped and it ended up growing two out and now it's getting more bushy and so basically was experimenting to see if it would work even though it was like this and so i might end up clipping these so that we can get more purple instead of the green old ones and then now you just see all the strawberry plants and the peppers and then the others here they are actually putting out strawberries since i de-weeded them and was able to we even have runners What the runners would do is normally go into the ground and try and produce a whole nother plant to get more strawberries. And so we're starting to get those strawberries here since the weeds are gone and stop taking all of the nutrients and so we're hoping to go ahead and get more All right, everybody, welcome back. Here are the strawberries now. After everything is clear, we still have a few weeds that decided to come back, as you can see, that we have to pluck out. And here are the strawberries flourishing a lot bigger. So here are the strawberries a lot, lot bigger. They are getting flowers and strawberries on them. The box is looking a whole lot better. The basil has gotten huge. Hoping to get those bigger also. Up there we have a few other starts. Okay, everyone. So here are the strawberry plants since we um, did our last update. It's been about two weeks. Maybe two and a half. And you can see that they have grown and put on a bunch of blooms. So definitely making sure the weeds which we have to come back in again um because of the rain that just came we have a few more grass seeds that have seeded themselves and grown up 
but yes i'm hoping that you can hear me over the wind um but they have definitely doubled if not tripled in size and have put on a good amount of blooms to where we're going to get us some you know more strawberries um as you can see here we have some here on the end that are not quite red or ripe yet but they are still looking good and then here in the bed plenty of blooms plenty of blooms where they were basically stagnant in growth and then you can see that zucchini plant has decided to just flourish it has doubled no i'm gonna say tripled or quadrupled in size um so yes blessed by that fruit and then even the pepper plant here in the um that purple basil has gotten huge and we're gonna go ahead and clip the top of that to go ahead and um harvest it and dry it out and then we are going to uh let that get bushier as well but yeah i just wanted to give you guys a update on how these strawberries are doing they're doing pretty good and we have lots of blooms so yeah thank you so much for tuning in to garden creek life like and subscribe leave comments if you wish Thanks for tuning in.